banana Ni nae obasi tuna bakana Hapo nyuma na sidika mena banana Mana kila day bana unaitangaza Katangaze bani Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog I'm so excited for this one cause Wow I have my book there I have my journal I have another book that I wrote my visions and my goals Anyway one of those goals that I had written down are coming true today and I'm so excited. Like, <laughs> I'm getting a delivery. You guys will see. It was on my vision for, I think I told you guys in my last vlog, it was on my vision for last year, but I didn't manage to do it. So it's happening this year. I wrote it in 2022s. Woo! I'm so excited. Like, I can't even contain myself. I'm waiting to get a, a call from the delivery person who is doing the delivery and tell me I'm here so we can pick it up. And of course, I'm going to show you guys. Please. Uh, I don't know whether to tell you now or like wait until it's here so that you guys can see it for yourselves and then we'll talk about it later. Right now, I'm just home with Bay. My mom is at church my sister is in school so they will be quite short and surprised when they come back home and find it here yeah. i'll try my best to film their reaction for you guys but for now it's just me and of course Ben knows about it but my mom and my sister they don't know i'm going to surprise them like this is something i have wanted to do for so long this is something that i have like desired like it's not you guys will see it and will be like like surely sarah this is what you're hyping up like that like everybody has it most people have have it like but to me it's not like that it's such a big deal to me guys if you watched my channel from kitambo like you know where i've come from and like trust you me i didn't even like show where exactly we came from i wish i was vlogging since the day that we were living in a single room so that you guys could understand why i get excited about things that to other people might seem as small or like just regular everyday things i'm super excited i'm super proud of myself like i've desired it from i don't know when i was so young when i used to go because my mom used to be a cleaner like house help house help in other people's homes like sometimes i would go with her and i see these things and i was like oh my god i can't wait for when i grow up i'm talking about when i was in primary school when i was so young like i can't wait for us to have such a house i can't wait for us to have such a thing i can't wait. like everything guys i've manifested it since i was young yo if i talk about, i start talking about where i have come from i start crying and if my mom tells you you guys will cry <laughs> you know the other day we were talking with Bay. there's a project she's working on so this topic came up which but i'm so excited guys for you to see i don't know where when the project will come out but whenever it will come out i'll obviously tell you guys but i'm so excited for you to see it what she's working on anyway so we were this topic came up and i was telling her wow when i look back you know about social classes because we were kind of talking about that i was telling her that i think you see because she was telling me you know every time you feel overwhelmed every time you feel like you're not pushing like things are not happening for you just take a step back and uh, or rather when i feel anxious about the future because i was telling her like how my anxiety is usually i'm always just scared i'm usually scared of like just going back to where we were like that is one of my biggest fears what is one of my biggest fears i'm not even gonna lie to you guys um i get anxious like oh my god what if one day like just things don't work out and then i'm not able to like sustain my family and myself and then we have to go back to where we were because let me tell you guys it was the ghetto it was bad so i was saying like you guys i know some might see me and see like oh so you are in such a better place i might see somebody else and i see oh my god you're such in a better place so i was we were saying practically i was saying in every situation that you are in there's somebody else who is wishing they were there 
trust you me <laughs> any situation even if you feel like uko chini aje ama feel uko like there's somebody like me right now i'm sure there's there's somebody who is like oh my god sarah like you're not even supposed to be worried if i had just what you have mind you i don't even have a lot but i'm sure there's somebody who's like if i had just what you have i would be so happy and the same thing i look at somebody else i'm like oh my god if i had what you have i would be so happy like that's the thing with human beings and life sometimes it's so hard to be contented anyway so she was telling me like if you feel like things are not working out just take a step back and look how far you have come it will give you peace to like reduce your anxiety you will be good anyway so we were talking about your the, that whole situation where i've given you guys like even if you think your life is bad like ukochini trust you me there's somebody else who is having our situation so i make this dark joke because I usually like making dark jokes about my past because otherwise I'll cry. But it's Italia because Mungo shot to our uko and we're going, we're going up and up and up. Period. I could not do it anymore. Anyway, amen. Anyway, so I made a dark joke and I was like, oh, like in you us from the situation where we were like when i was young growing up like in high school and in secondary school I rem in primary school i remember we didn't even have like 30 shillings to buy petroleum jelly kwa stove so we can cook we used to borrow i remember we used to buy skuma wikis at 10 bob and then tunaeka maji tuna inakuwa na supu tunakula na ugali and it was just the ghetto mboshes at 10 bob if you guys remember when they used to pima mboshes at 10 bob tuna jaza maji kuna time we used to buy nyanya bondeka like tunazikaranga tu hivo to nakitungu and then to nakula no gali kama hiyo ni stew like i remember like how bad it was like how to do it was so bad guys it was bad it was bad like to kishi single room and stuff and at that time my mom is pregnant we don't have food she's eating ugali with water and say oh she's breastfeeding my sister and i was like I was telling me what the joke that I made was at that point I didn't I don't think there's anybody who was below us. It was literally us and then the next person who is below us, it's like the street kids, like you know, street kids like that was the level that we were guys like we're just thankful we had like shelter and like access to water and your food that a kama like you food that in you know ya kukula but to kulala nja atakama tulikuwa tu tuna boil tu mandizi me and my mom we eat and sleep like it was a lot so just always remember that and actually that ni alini pair was really helpful like anytime that i feel like my things are slowing down like i just have to take step back it's not that i was feeling like things are slowing down but mostly about my anxiety about the future like look at how far you have come literally like we were like if you guys know about the lowest class like the lowest lowest social class the like it was literally us and then street kids. like it was that bad like i just really thank god and for whatever like i'm getting today to be happening i'm so thankful and i hope that advice will help you guys i've talked for eight minutes i'm so sorry this was not supposed to be a rambling video this was not supposed to be like an advice video but i just thought it's something that can help you especially if like you get anxious and stuff like just look at how far god have brought you and be like if he has brought me this far where would he take me back yeah as far as you're not being a bad person at you mkwana kiburi know that i'm a kubles and now he feels the need to take it away if you're still being a good person you're assisting where you can you're supporting other people where you can like where would god not bless you more like he will keep elevating you so don't worry just like be a good person thank god be grateful and everything will be fine Eh, yo, shout out to anybody. First of all, if you've been brought up by a single mother, and second of all, if you guys had nothing, nothing like, cause 
anytime i remember when i was growing up my mom has done like the hardest jobs her whole life even the fact that you know she's not going to work like she's like she's at home ama she goes to church ama do is and i relax too like she has even added weight like she looks oh my god she's even glowing you guys i'm like i'm so grateful to god that but that's something else I had written on my book that I'm going to retire my mom from your job because but I didn't even know that it would happen that soon although it was because Ivo Vinyalukwa may get unwell but still things have to happen so that like blessings in this guys and God will keep blessing me amen period God will keep blessing your people like I don't know what I'm saying I might end up like clearing like deleting that whole part editing it out but i'm telling you my mom has done the hardest jobs from like kwa house help kufulia watu mangoku osha watu like just the hardest and mind you at that point she, my sister was so young she used to carry her walk all the way like they were distance where my mom had to go every day and clean people's houses cook for them wash their houses like it was a lot my mom has suffered like sometimes she makes me mad but thinking kumbuka too i'm just like wow it's crazy anyway <laughs> ah it's so that she makes me mad that he like me mad yeah like just the normal family like arguments like is it written on dog like if you live with your family you know it's not anything crazy but she has suffered to raise me and my sister i'm not gonna lie to you guys anyway i'm super excited for the delivery and i'll show you guys once it gets here let me just go and chill and calm down and i'll be okay okay so they are here i'm going to open the gate <laughs> Ouch, my boobs are so painful. Oh, I'm so excited. So, there is any Akisha, let me have a quick plug in. So, let me quick up. Also, so say you see, let me quick up. I end up talking to Oh my god, I'm so excited. I can't even like talk well. Guys, by now I'm sure you've already seen what I got. You can't see it from here. I, I don't know. Maybe I need to adjust my camera or something. But I'm um, talking like that because, like, I'm just from climbing the stairs, like, back and forth. Also, no, I'm dirty, but it's okay. I'm gonna shower and change because I was carrying the table that was here. It was dirty. I know my clothes are dirty, but I'm so excited. You guys think it was worth that whole speech that I was giving you? Probably to some of you will be like, oh, that's what made you talk like that. But let me take the invoice. Her. It's written C 
Sarah Waru. Sarah Mudani. Okay, I used my other name. Sarah Mudani. Pie. <laughs> I'm the owner. Anyway, I got it for my family, but I'm so excited. That's my signature. That's my name. Anyway, I got it directly from Hot Points site because they had a specific sale for this one. Let me show you. Hopefully, I'm Tana. That's beauty. They had an online specific sale. You know what I usually like to do when I'm buying, like, even the fridge I got it from online. When I'm buying, like, super huge electronics, go to the specific companies, like, this one is Vaughn. This is also Vaughn. Let's say if you're buying from LG, Lampton, Smika, all those like companies, go to their specific website and order from them. So it's not like you're ordering from a third party. Their own website. And then you order. They usually do free delivery and free installation. But if you buy to, from the supermarket, you have to pay delivery. You have a, I don't know to pay the installation. Anyway, I just think that's a nice way of like saving some coins so i got from directly from hot points what is it called website because gosh sharp at a magic but you guys can't see yeah and this one specifically was on offer when i was writing down on my vision board i had written six banner this one is a four banner as you guys can have seen it's a three gas and one electric and then it has oven and stuff here Oh, I can't wait for all the food I cook with this thing. Anyway, on my vision, but I'd written the six banner. But it's okay. I'll still one day I'll get the six banner. Even if I got the six banner here, yeah, I don't think it can fit because the space is not that big. But one day, probably soon. You know, I'm so grateful for this one. Like yeah, it's not scared too poor. I can't wait for my mom and my sister to see it when they come back home. Because I had not told them anything at all. It's going to back to your yote. So, um, my initial plan when I decided I'll just get a four banner right now. When I was writing on my vision board the six banner, I know I was going to buy the four banner. I was just writing six so that if, in case I don't get six, I know obviously I'll get the four one. So, you know, even if I fall, I'm not falling that far. But I knew that I'm going to get right now, for now, the four banner. But I wrote the six banner because it has been a dream of mine one day that I'll get a six banner one. You know, the super huge one. Anyway, when I was checking, when I said I'm um, okay going now to buy the four banner, I was buying the one that usually, you know, the regular one that goes for 35k. And then I saw this one. I think it's bigger and slightly advanced than that other one it was on sale and then i saw it was on sale so initially it was going for forty three thousand. probably if i remember when i'm editing i'll insert a screenshot here it was going for forty three thousand, but it was on sale discounted for four thousand so it was going for 39 and i got an eye on too i'll show you guys i also got an eye on because i've been saying for the oh my god i'm sweating i've been saying for the longest time i'm going to get an eye on for my clothes, for my clothes, I finally got it still from Hot Point. It got delivered together with this one. I'm so happy, guys. You guys have no idea. Like, that's too poor. So, yeah, that's the discount. I don't know when it's ending. Is it 19th? Hopefully, by the time I'm posting this vlog, in case you guys want to get it, hopefully the offer will still be there. But I don't know, guys. Just go to, I particularly just went to Vaughn's Instagram. And then click the link of their website and that's where i got the sale i had checked ramtons they didn't have a sale i checked lg they didn't have and then i was like you know what even the fridge is one let me also get a one in it and then you can you can offer nothing poor i'm really happy let me test and see if i'll be able to like wash out the way i've been showing so you know this this plot is it's making me mad first of all they have never fixed a socket for the fridge so we usually use the cooker socket for the fridge you see they have never fixed the fridge one now we can't like in case you want to use the oven you have to first unplug the this one 
so that we can use the oven i don't know we asked them to fix a long time ago they have never done it even today when this thing was being brought in the gate anyway, i'm not going to let negative energy interfere in this video because the most important thing here at Imefika, i had to cut up the gate in the vunjoa because apparently there is no keys of the gate like because it had to be opened the whole gate since it could not fit you know on the passengers gate like the kitty is saying there's no keys and even when she makes like phone calls nobody knows where the keys are to the gate like what you guys don't have keys for the gate anyway you know i was like it's okay and now i have to look for because like how you guys don't how comes you guys don't have it? anyway it's okay i have my product i'm not going to let any negative energy interfere i'm so happy i'm so thankful to god yo i've been talking again for so long let me show you guys how that delivery person showed me how it's used because me i don't know <laughs> me not lie to you so there's two options where you can attach the extension to the socket and then you just open it automatically or you use your kiberiti i don't know what key, matchbox use your matchbox when it's not plugged down and you just you know what let me look for a different angle where you guys will be able to see me so my sister just came back from school Fresh. I'm telling you, we are Hawaii. I'm telling you, we are Hawaii. I'm telling you, we are Hawaii. I'm telling you, we are Smart. So this one is this. I have to be checking this one is away. And gosh. Let me see. Ah I have to get used to that. Anyway, it's either that or like I just plug there and I don't have to use a matchbox. I just open like this and then it opens yeah i'm so exhausted i need to go and shower but i'll obviously show you guys the iron that i got so i've not learned and I'm, I'm super excited congrats sarah anyway <laughs> guys i'll see you guys later in case i just realized i didn't show our previous cooker it was this one and then you just do this you know it has these two cookers so i'll just put it aside there oh my god can you guys remember when i got this this on one of my vlogs i got it from my mom i think it was for her birthday uh last year is it last year oh my gosh if it's last year i'm gonna be so shocked i got it from my mom last year and then now this year we have this oh god it's so good and i've also done the hard work and also thank you guys for subscribing and watching my content yeah <sighs> to bigger and better i'm so thankful for this though very thankful